I wanted to share with you what I did to teach my dog to catch a frisbee. The first thing I did is I bought two frisbees. And uh, one of the things that I took into, into consideration is that it needed to be a soft frisbee. And there are some frisbees out there that are very hard and they can they can hurt your dog when, when he or she is trying to catch it. So buy something that is flexible, that is rubber. Uh, there's out there some, some really good ones and uh, do your research and make sure that uh, your dog is safe. Buy two frisbees. This is important because slowly your your dog will learn how to take one frisbee and then drop the other one when the second one is offered to him once you have your two frisbees just toss them around let your dog play with them let your dog really get uh, used to them use them as toys uh, you want to make sure that your dog gets engaged as much as possible you can play a tug of war game with your dog. You know, let your dog take the frisbee, keep it in his mouth as long as he wants. Always use the two frisbees. Uh, again, you know, we want to make sure that he knows that, you know, he needs to drop one frisbee when, when it's required. So give your dog treats for the desired behavior. Once he's doing the right things, the things that you want him to do, give them treats. You want to reinforce that as much as possible. I can't stress enough that it's very important for your dog to really get into it. So this might take some time depending on your dog. Some, some uh, dog breeds are easier to train than others. The dog in this video is a 10 month old uh, Border Collie and we began the training at 8 months. Next, you want to get your dog to take the frisbee off your hands while you are moving the frisbee away from him as it's shown here. Always re reward uh, with treats for good behavior. Remember that it is a game and it needs to be fun, but at the same time, you need to let your dog know what's expected of him. Once you pass the previous steps, it is time to throw the frisbee, but you have to be patient. Depending on the dog breed, this could take days or months, but do not give up. Just work on it every day if possible. When I want my dog to drop a frisbee, I do a signal with my hands and also tell him to drop it at the same time. This, this really works well. One thing that I noticed is that when there's other dogs around, my dog will want to play with them. So he will not be interested in, in playing frisbee with, frisbee with me. So I would really suggest to train where you have undivided attention. Any dog will learn how to catch a frisbee. It just takes time, a lot of training, uh, hard work. You really need to put in the time. You have to do it every day and you have to be consistent with what you're teaching your dog. I hope this video helps. And if you have any questions, uh, just use the comment section below. Thank you.